Cheers from Nuked London, home of the best three-eyed fish and chips in the Milky Way. The Hatriots hooligans have been drinking all morning here outside Flemley Stadium, and they are ready for blood. Remember, in the MFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The New Orleans Zombies battle the Nuked London Hatriots. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bumblebee park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. Hot one, hot two, three. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot three. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The cornerback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can... He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Manji. The new game from Wilton Crabtree. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? when they're not young. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Wow, the quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Ooh. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. <laughs> I know, I hate those zebra men. <laughs> Second down, and, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Yeah. 
Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. One, hot two, hot three. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection, too. Uh, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. <laughs> He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Now hold on. Looks like the offense has recovered it. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. There might not be an eye in team, but this guy's eyeballs are all over the other team's helmets right now. <laughs> oh, man. You know, before this guy was in the Mutant Football League, I believe he was in uh, the Human League. Why did he leave? Eh, they didn't want him. Okay. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Nice time warp dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait a minute. What the? Ah, did they? Didn't they just? Ah, am I losing my mind, or did that play that I saw just not happen? Ah, I gotta stop smoking them on tiny laundry pods. And it's first and ten. your buzz on in the NFL. Oh, he just got crushed. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And there's another. Oh, man. He just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. meets the explodable object. <laughs> and 
and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. First down, and this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, telling me, nice run. No, I mean he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. Hot, hot one. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Boom, and like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I... Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Matt, oh, with the punishing hit. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. down and long. Great chance for a big game. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated, and I'm a team agnostic. Now well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. And he's got a chance. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. Second down and six. He's not going down. Boom, dead and down. Sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. Third and two. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, this 
This is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Yeah. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. And he's running. And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth. What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something Unique About Yourself. That's unique. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy, and that's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. And I'm two fists into this bottle of scotch. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't almost throw interceptions, but when I do, he scores! Any mistakes here? Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned on the light. It wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. hit me so hard I went into a dark the offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster they better be careful because when those guys die it's forfeit city third and four Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. The 30. He's in, and that's why they call it the money shot. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence. It looks like we've got a penalty here. First and two. Perfect pass and the score! Touchdown! I don't know if you're aware of this, but for every touchdown he scored, he drinks.
drinks the blood of his enemies and donates a thousand dollars to a local children's hospital. What a player! Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first and ten. for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Two minutes left in the half. Second down and six. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the timeout during halftime. Third down and the punter is warming up. Oh, that gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? Smash a clock! That's not a great enemy! We're not talking about waking up at the crack of dude. We're talking about the MF. The defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. And the quarterback throws another pick. Oh man, talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay, he just ran into a buzzsaw. And it's first and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. Second down and ten. Oh, and that quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britch's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she and that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Ah, another interception. 
Jeez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than ever. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. <laughs> The kicker should make this. Defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. was bricks kind of like your aunt bertha this guy had and that's the end of the second quarter someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers stay with us for the halftime show brought to you by our friends at monsatan industries we make genetically altered franken food you'll have fun trying to identify welcome back hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I'd do. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> Second down and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards. Third down and five. Send a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. <laughs> the offense lost their last quarterback. Next time their offense comes out on the field, they will have to forfeit the game. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just... The Nuke London Patriots obliterate their opponent today and win the game by forfeit. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? I think the mission I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, man, I want to laugh. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Oh. 
Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.